In this video, we will learn how to use Power Automate to receive an email when a new Microsoft Forms response is submitted. To start, we're going to use Power Automate. We're going to set up a new automated cloud flow. For this example, I'm just going to name my flow test form email response. Now for the trigger, what we need is a Microsoft Forms when a new response is submitted. So I can search that in here. In this case, that's already at the top. So I'm gonna go ahead and select that trigger and click Create. The first thing we need to do is, is pick a form. So you see there's a drop down um, menu here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our form ID um, directly from the URL of our Microsoft Forms. So I've got that open in this tab here. And what the form ID is, is in the URL, you'll see the part of the URL contains this ID equals. And the part of the URL after the equal sign is the form ID. So if I copy that and enter a custom value, I'm going to paste it in here, and I'm just going to click and paste it in here, just like that. OK, now I've got my form ID in there. Um, and the idea here is that we want to receive an email um, anytime someone submits this test form here. So the next thing is I'm going to add a new step and I'm gonna choose a send an email activity. We're gonna use Office 365 Outlook. I'm gonna select that. And I wanna send it, in this case, I'm just gonna send it to myself. And my subject line will be new request form submission received and the body of the email um, what i'll do is i'll actually have a, a link directly to the form responses so that i can just um, click on that and they'll take me directly to my form responses so i'm going to go ahead and click save saving ready to test. So let's actually quick do a test. So we'll go to the form. I'm just going to fill this out. Put in my preview. Submit that. And I'm going to quick check my email to see that that um, response or that uh, email was triggered um, based on my, on my cloud flow. Um, so I'm actually going to go back over here and I'm going to click refresh on all runs and I'll see that that test um, succeeded and it only took one second to run. Um, and so we know that our run was successful and that is how you set up Power Automate to send an email to you. Uh, anytime someone submits a Microsoft Forms response. Just to end with a side note that if you actually um, go to your Microsoft Forms and you look over here, you can go into your um, settings. There's actually an, an option here um, to allow receipt of responses after submitted, after submission and also get email notification of each response. Um, but this allows for a little bit further customization of um, what you want to, what you want that uh, email notification to uh, contain. So it's a little bit more robust than simply saying get an email notification of each response. Uh, so hope you, hopefully you found that useful. Um, let me know how it goes for you. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks and take care.